Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can find HTML table and then get the row count from that. So for this test, I'm using Flag Day Australia Wikipedia page and they have this table on the right side of the page named as Australian National Flag Day. So I'm going to get class name for that and then I will use this as selector to find this class. So the class is Infobox V Event. So let's go to the Eclipse project and I have open QA Selenium, open QA Selenium Firefox driver already imported. So let's create instance of Firefox. Okay, now I copied that web page URL. Let's create a list. Type in web element and then go for txt equals to driver dot find elements because we are trying to count the rows check by dot css selector and here we will type in full path for our table table info box we event dot sorry then point to T body and TR. Okay, now you find that, then simply print out system out println txt dot size. Okay, so at the end of this line. Let's import Chama util list. Now, once you import that, there won't be any errors. Okay, so let's execute the program and find out what is the size of that table. So number of rows should be around eight or maybe, yeah, eight. Okay, so let's run the project. Okay, so it is loading the web page and on console you will find it as your row count. You can also make it a bit readable by typing row count plus. Okay, simply rerun the project. So it will load the web page and on console you will find row count equals to it. So now you know how to get the HTML table and then point to that particular set of rows and then with the help of list we will collect those rows in it and print out the size of that list. So you get the row count.